G'day, my name is Tom. This is the Tathless YouTube channel. Welcome back to our Euro Truck Simulator Let's Play, episode 43. Um, last episode, we ended up here in La Havre. I was in a little, little bit of a hurry, so I do apologize if I was like talking like I was in a hurry. That's because I was, because I had two other videos to edit yesterday's video, and Monday's video, and Sunday's video. I had that three, yeah, like three videos to edit in one day, so now we're going to chill out a little bit. Now, today's Monday when I record this, you'll see this on Wednesday, so today we're going to cover Monday's news, and then we'll cover Tuesday's and today's news on Thursday. We've got a couple of news to see what to talk about today, so without further ado, let's get a good old cold start on the Peterbilt 389, our trusted Peterbilt 389, with... She's, about, she's probably going to turn the big one seven, the big 17,000 today. Uh, we're at 16,229 at the moment. We might be hitting 17,000 kilometres today. I hope so. She's my baby girl. I love this. I love this thing. She has been a dream, honestly. Um, and we'll see how much we're getting paid. We may be getting the Mercedes back uh, very soon. Oh, I'm not into my accent. Let's go. Do have a check engine light on the dashboard, so we have to get that sorted eventually. We might be stopping by the service centre around the corner. Uh, we are at. I forgot what the company's called. Feed, you think it's cool? Feed? Oh, I don't know what the voice is No, Globe Euro. We started the feed yesterday. The Globe Euro. Here in the Harvray Paris. Part of the standard map. And today, we'll take a nice leisurely drive from the Harvray to Wexford. And it is a 927 kilometre drive, so it is going to be a fairly long video. I do apologise for that. We are hauling nine tons of oil filters. Obviously, oh, that's going to go, be going into some cars, getting oil changes up in Wexford. We're going to drop them off at Lisette Logistics, and we are getting nineteen thousand euros for the job, which is not too bad. So, we're pretty much driving the way we came. So, we'll be stopping at the service centre around the corner, and then we'll be going, cutting, uh, doing a huge cut through the United Kingdom. Do I have? I've got. I feel like I'm missing towns, but I'm not. So yeah, we'll be cutting through at London, go to Fish Garden, get off the Fish Garden, get to Ireland, and that's where we we'll end the video. So let's, very adventurous drive, let's get on with it. Start reversing, I think I just made, oh, I'm in the wrong gear. Okay, we got some engine car, fuck. So let's do it. First we'll stop by the service centre, uh, we'll be hearing um, our good friend in the middle, oh, I don't know if we're friends anymore, but uh, hey, we'll find out. Have any size that she's giving us a year on top, so let's find out what mood she's in. Let's find out. Welcome to the next test. All successful tests will be rewarded with cake. All unsuccessful tests will be punished with deadly neurotoxin. Alright, she's still going about the neurotoxin. I'm surprised we haven't got any neurotoxin yet. Oh, I love this voice. Remember, it's in the description below if you want to download it. As well as every other mod that has been featured in this Let's Play will be in the description below. So go ahead and click show more. Don't forget to click the like button if you're enjoying this series. If you're stopping by for the first turn time, left. please subscribe. We are going to do a quick turn here. We are clear. Well, away we go. And we have updated our mod. It's obviously updated to 12.3 on the uh, good old... Um, uh, AI traffic, so we get in on Mr. Devaro's and Jaguar I paces. So we're going to have a quick stop at the service centre to get this truck fixed. Oh, I'll well, get it. Uh, oops. That's my fault. I was technically I was distracted driving because I was trying to get the fuel economy up, but we're going to get fixed. If we need it. That was my, that was my bad. Anyway, so there's a so there's a garage there, if we want to stop at the garage, we might get a garage in each um, country we've so miles. Far. Please turn left. And in case you are wondering, if you are new to the series, our goal today, well our goal for this series, I should say, not just for today, this whole series, our goal is to... Oh, you are a rebel. I see. No worries. I'll just rebel against your health and warm up the neurotoxin pumps while I recalculate. Fix this down. Front load cost us five thousand euros. That's not too bad. Okay, that light does all those lights to go away. Put that back on. 
Well, we should have our high gears back too, because we didn't have high gears. Alright, well, away we go. Let's get on the road. Like, actually on the road. Let's go. A big 927 kilometre drive in front of us will be hitting 17,000 kilometres a day. We're doing at least 1,000 kilometres per day in the pit with 389 and I love it. When I'm recording that video, I, I, by the way, I apologise if I sound like I'm eating something. I'm actually sucking on a front wheel. Please turn left. left. As I call. Because. That's so. Coffee, coffee, coffee. coffee. Actually, Please turn left. At the roundabout, please take the second exit. Please take the exit. Cruiser, I think the Land Cruiser has always been a V8 diesel. 
Uh, it's kind of like when Mercedes in 2022 is going to go from an 8 cylinder for C63 to a full cylinder. The AMG C63 has always been an 8 cylinder. Now, I'm pretty sure they're doing this due to fuel economy, which is cool. I mean, obviously, with, um, fuel prices are crazy. Well, I mean, they're really, really, really cheap. So, obviously, if you have like an Lamborghini or something like that, you can afford to get petrol. Yeah. For the first time ever, I believe, because less than a dollar per litre, which is crazy. Um, for 91 um, petrol, that is, obviously, if you have a um, Lamborghini, you'll be using 98, which is our um, highest octane in Australia, 98 for an ROM, which is probably like 93 or something like that. Very slow, so it's your 93 in America. So, yeah, um, I'm, de I'm definitely not really, um, in, uh, <coughs> excuse me. Um, see, I'm not really agreeing with Toyota going for a 2.8 litre diesel because the thing with the Toyota Land Cruiser, especially here in Australia, I'm pretty sure everywhere else that has diesel for Land Cruiser, except for America, that's V8. Yeah, downside, uh, downside, I'm not really a big fan. I believe their petrol motor is going down to a V6 as well, which is like, when was there a V6 anything for the Land Cruiser? Like a turbo, twin turbo V6 or something, turbo V6 or something like that. I mean, come on. That's just like, well, obviously the Raptor, the Ford Raptor that we know a lot of. Yeah. Well, you guys know a lot of the states. We rarely see it, but there's one of them right town, a blue one, um, first gen. Um, please keep right, then please exit right. Um, has a. Uh, went from a 6.2 litre V8 to a 3.5 litre turbo V6. Please exit right. And not many people were, were happy with the decision, but people were happy, most trucks are pretty happy with them. Um, I know for a fact Nick from AR Talk Gaming has a um, Ford Raptor and he loves it. To bits, because he got rid of his Nissan GTR to get it and he still has it, which is amazing. I think he bought a brand new in 2018. Please keep had, left. It's crazy, he's nearly had that truck for two years. I hope he never gets rid of it. But I think he's planning to get his Subaru back. Now, if you're in the Ontario area, go find his Subaru and let him go and see it. Um, I really want to see it back. So, yeah, that's the Toyota news. Now, we're going to cover some concepts. Um, a concept news uh, that I just found out before I started recording this video is Skoda. Now, Skoda, if you don't know, is a. Um, if you're like, not from <coughs> anywhere that sells Skoda, Skoda is a. I think it's Czech Republic. And it's uh, a um, Czech Republic version of the Volkswagen. Like you have Audi, Volkswagen, uh, Bugatti, Lamborghini, excuse me, uh, Bugatti, Lamborghini, uh, what else is there? Uh, Porsche, uh, yeah, Porsche, depending on how you want to say it, I don't even really care how to say it. Uh, uh, like all of those cars are based on the Volkswagen. Oh, oh uh, Porsche, I think Porsche is Volkswagen, I'm not too sure. I think they are. No, 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 Peugeot's are. I think they used to, though, weren't they? Were Peugeot's Volkswagens? Nah, they weren't. What am I talking about? Well, Peugeot's a different thing. Um, yeah, like all of that group, um, obviously they have released a new concept, and that is for the 2021. It's got a name. Skoda. I'll find it. Get a bit of this. Started with taste, Skoda Tab Cup or something, Tab Cup or something like that, or Tab Luck or something like that. Um, if you know what it is, let me know in the comments below. It looked pretty cool, honestly. Uh, would I own one? No. I mean, the only if you continue to improperly manage this okay. vehicle's speed, I may just have to get the neurotoxin emitters of them running. Oh, slow down. Right, we're going for a toll. Ah, <laughs> we're all going for a toll. Thank you. See you later, mate. Have a good one. Oh, that's say it. Say it's part of the Volkswagen like 2 on my grandparents now. Three say it. Um, in the UK. Well, it's poor fair, mate. I'm getting nervous with the coronavirus and all that kind of things. Um, my grandpa especially. Um, which if you 
game, which I don't think you are. Um, yeah, you're not going to get it. Uh, we've already been through a tough time already. Um, um, I doubt we'll be getting it. Um, we don't have to watch out for people with masks, so they have more than likely. Society, which is definitely a very scary time I'm living in. I hope you guys are, that are in quarantine, staying at home, self isolating, are doing okay. Um, I've been reading and hearing a lot of news, I've been watching the news about this uh, virus, and it's just crazy. Like, I've never experienced anything like this. I mean, come on. There's nothing that's been in my generation that's been crazy as is. <coughs> Having the um, world take stay at home, stay at home, self isolating, not make, not, and pretty much not allowing us to travel, not allowing us to uh, go to work. Some people have lost their jobs, I think a friend of mine has lost their job. Please keep right, um, then please exit right. Due to the fact of the virus, the temporary redundant my auntie has. Please exit job. right. It's definitely a struggle, to, a struggle worthy time. Some people are still working at least. So if you are still working, let me know that. In 0 0.1 miles, and, please turn left. And how's the company going? And if they're not, hopefully they're still kicking strong during this horrible time. Please um, turn left. I'm, feel, I'm fairly out for you guys, I'm honestly. Yeah. I am really. I'm just going down yeah, because this car is just past this turn. I'm trying to turn it. Please turn right. Yeah, yeah, so yeah, if you are a part of that, I'll, yeah, I am so sorry for you. It will get over, you will get over it, and you'll be back to work in no time. <coughs> uh, because, um, this fire, I mean, honestly, it's like, it's that crazy. I'm not worried to go on the because YouTube might delete the video or something like that, which I don't want to do. I don't want that to happen. Why is he driving down here? I've never seen AI take the train or anything. Yeah, that's it. Round we go. We're just going to Look, I've got my old car showing. I've got no feet on my feet. So it's like when I failed to do that well more truck job. So yeah. <coughs> so, oh, why was I talking about that? Just, I was just randomly start talking yeah, about the coronavirus for some reason. But yeah, so that new Skoda looks pretty cool. So that is the car news. I've I, I lost track of four because I just started talking about the coronavirus and stuff like that. Um, yeah. Honestly, I honestly have lost track before. Right, whilst we're on the train going to Folkestone, I'm actually going to find out what that car is called so I can tell you what, it, what it's about. Because obviously this is going to take a lot of work. Or is it? Yeah, it is. Well done. Now I have to recalculate a new route because of your mistake. <coughs> May I remind you of the belt and narrow toxin emitters? Why did I say it in Roadstead years? Was it Skoda? Well done. You have completely ignored my instructions. Now I have to recalculate. This won't look good on your record. Sure. I'll come back to you in a bit. Okay, I've lost the story. Uh, it must have been day a bit. I did see it. Something to do with the Skoda tab lock, I think it's cool. That's been like tab. Obviously, it's gone, so I don't know. So cool. Uh, we are probably going to get some, we are going to get some YouTube, uh, YouTube news out of the way. So let's just get my dash back up so we can get going. So I can keep track on the good old fuel economy of the free air. We'll take a photo when we get to Ireland. <coughs> Uh, 16, 41, 6, we're up to now. Okay, I'm going to go out so we can go with that. 
We have to go to Miles Per Hour. I just realised I haven't changed to Miles. I'm an idiot. Because uh, we have to go to Miles. I think when we get to um, Ireland, is it kilometres? I think it is. So let me just switch back to Miles. <coughs> right, let's go. Let's take off. Please keep right, then, please exit right. Please exit right. Please continue straight. Continue our way through London. Please keep right.
Please keep left. Please keep left, then please exit left. Please exit left. Please keep left. Oh, 
to another freeway, lots of freeways to take. This is the freeway we've never been on. Of course we don't think we simply have to go to this area.
Please continue straight. Please keep right. Then, please continue straight. Please continue straight. Please continue straight. be back in a second and there'll be a second video but a couple minutes away because I'm busty and I'll see you then. Alright I'm back I'm feeling better let's get going. That feels better out than it.
red light runs on the Peterbilt. The T is pretty quick. Alright, I need to get out of this way. Come on. Come about. Come on, uh, Volvo. Let's go. Oh, Volvo. Mercedes. Please keep right. Then, please continue straight. I'm legit about to red light over here. Please continue straight. Mark Spain, why are you doing the UK? Well, since there's a drag eye place, that's a new car. <coughs> Do we have a, that looks like a Alpha, maybe? Got an Audi station wagon. Again, I'm still car spotting. Trip as well as the previous trip that we did. 
Uh, looks like I'm turning right up here. Me, because I'm driving left. Roundabout. Please take the second exit. Please take the exit. At the roundabout, please take the second exit. You're turning left with no indicator. Thank you. I guess, I mean... Please take the exit. the roundabout. Please take the second exit. Please take the exit. Some people need to do it. Like indicate all At the roundabout. Please take the second exit. Please take the exit. The roundabout. Please take Here the first miles. exit. Right, let's do that. So we'll turn it into Please the take the exit. Like that. That would that would be a cool uh, that would be a cool uh, angle. So we need to figure out how to leave my steering wheel like that. So I'm gonna go into photo studio. Let's see how good that will look. Like turning into the roundabout. We've got the indicator on and everything. So let's do that. Yeah. Let's go to the. I think this is the top. Oh, yeah, this is the top. Oh, yeah. This is what it's going to be. Yeah, whatever. Ah, uh, whatever. Let's turn it off. 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 Please take the exit. Okay, we made it. Fish guard. Well, apparently we have discovered fish guard. I don't think we have. So we have. At 
at the roundabout. Please take the third exit. Please take the exit. At the roundabout. Please take the first exit. Please take the exit. Please continue focus. straight. Just in case, uh, this is our boat to Ireland. So apparently, this is no entry. Alright. Oh, you are a rebel. I see. Oh, no worries. I'll yeah, just rebel right. against your health and warm up the new well dogs and pumps while I have recalculate. completely ignored my instructions. Now I have to recalculate. Right, this won't look good on your Ireland. record. Ross Lair, we are going to the three hour, nine hour trip and it's 273 euros. We're good for money, so we'll get on for it, even though we have to pay for something. So let's go to Ross Lair. We are entering Ireland for the first time ever. We have managed Well done. You have completely ignored my instructions. Now I have to recalculate. This won't look good on your record. Probably like it, yeah. No, I think we're going for like an hour. I think I started about half past 8pm one day. Right, let's get to Wexford, which is. Let's find out what units they use in New York. Well done. Now I have to recalculate a new route because of your mistake. May I remind you of the belt and narrow toxin emitters? the roundabout. Please take the second exit. Please take the exit. Australia pretty much. Let's just switch to the controllers. It's about to be 50 kilometers per hour and not 30, 50 miles, not 31, 51 miles, 50 miles per hour. I don't know what I'm talking about. I've had a long day. Please keep right, then, please keep left. Please keep left. In Sorrow Point, one miles, please turn right. Please turn right. Well done. You have completed the test. Congratulatory cake will be dispensed momentarily.
go to the island, we have made it, we have done light to the way. Should be excellent, what's that pivotal? Take 800 euros, that's not too bad. I'll take it. Right. That's the end of today's video. Right, the next video, if nothing changes, we will be going from... Because it'll be on a Thursday. We'll be going from here in Wexford, Holy Camp Beach, to Geneva in Switzerland. I believe that's Switzerland. No, Geneva, yeah. Yeah, in there. Just outside of Switzerland. Which is a 1400 kilometer drive, so that's another big drive tomorrow, so stay tuned for that if you are into the big drives. Otherwise, you can skip on to the next episode. But that's it for this episode. Episode 43 of ETS2 is coming to a close. If you like this video, make sure you hit the like button down below. If you're stopping by for the first time, please subscribe. Tune in on Thursday, aka tomorrow, when we do a video from Wexford to Geneva, hauling 16 tons of canned beans to. And it's going to cost, it's going to cost them 30,000 euros to pay me. So we have to be extra, extra careful and try not, and apparently we can change the trailer if we wanted to. We might haul a pro watch trailer tomorrow. Why not? Um, yeah, so that's it for this video. If you like this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. If you're stopping by for the first time, please subscribe. Take care, have a good one. Bye-bye.